Hi, this is Jeff. Today I'd like to talk to you about drains. This particular drain right here has been the standard of the industry for years. It's a twist waste drain. So as you twist the handle, internally a pop-up goes up and down, just like your bathroom sink at home. Now if this were a lever waste drain, the handle would move up and down, but it would still be actuating the pop-up mechanism on the inside. The problem with this drain and the pop-up mechanism is the O-ring. As this drain sits on your distributor's shelf for months, ozone is attacking that neoprene O-ring. When it's installed in a three-compartment sink, the uh, in the detergent side of the sink, the detergent attacks the O-ring, the sanitizing agent attacks the O-ring, and the O-ring gets hard, brittle, cracks, and comes off. The other part of this drain that's a problem is the actual brass that is made over in China. Virtually every single one, every single twist drain sold in America is made in China, regardless of brand, and they're all exactly the same. Over there, what they do is they put in a lot of zinc into the brass, which is a sacrificial metal that just goes away over time. As the metal disappears, you develop pinholes in the casting. Now you have water on the floor. Again, the plumber comes in and replaces the drain. It's all about expense. Now, let me show you today's new standard for drains, the Fisher Drain King. The Drain King uses a ball valve. You still get the same twisting action that you got with the twist waste drain, except now we're using a ball valve. I always ask myself the question, well, why a ball valve? Well, why do you use a ball valve when you're dealing with natural gas in a commercial kitchen? You always use ball valves around natural gas simply because ball valves don't leak. So now here is the first drain on the market that is a ball valve that doesn't leak. It's the only no leak drain on the market. The other thing about uh, this drain is the brass. We use red brass, which has got a lot of copper in it and a lot of bronze in it, very little zinc. So you're not gonna get that sacrificial metal disappearing. We use stainless steel in the sink compartment because it matches the sink compartment. It comes with a flat strainer, or also you can order them with the basket strainer that sits inside. We use two threads on the connection, a two inch OD thread, inch and a half ID. No need for any additional adapters. The plumber can make that connection when they manifold the three drains together. The Fisher Drain King also incorporates a universal sealing angle. This is the angle that sinks are dimpled in the bottom of the sink compartment and this drain is designed to go up real flush right up against that dimple for a very good sealing. Again, we use a solid stainless steel clamping ring for easy installation into that sink compartment. We also make these with overflow connections. We also make them vandal proof for the prison industry. We make about 27 different model numbers of, <clears throat> of these drains. And uh, so you just need to go into the catalog and pick the drain that, that's, that suits your requirements. Fisher Waste Files have acquired a reputation over the years for highest quality, a quality that is unequaled. Thank you very much for listening.